Hello everyone, this is Sai Soldier here. Welcome back to our Let's Play in the Sky, playing as the merchant here. Um, I just filled up our cargo hold, and we're still sitting here with uh, 1.49 million credits. I kind of think, uh, kind of think I'd like to go ahead and buy one more heavy shuttle here. It cost us 489,000 credits. Uh, yeah, that's going to be pretty close to wiping us out. Conquer. What is it, seven now? We got seven of these puppies. So let's go ahead and buy a few more tons of metal. And go ahead and depart, set our course. Thankfully, we're able to protect these guys with like three mules here. We can protect them quite nicely, actually. I pity the fool who tries to uh, interfere with us. They are probably going to either be destroyed or boarded. Either one is a death sentence. Oh. Look this guy right here. Whoa, 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 stop. I freaking stupid Republic. Oh well. I hate the Republic. I think I want to work for the Syndicate. We might land on some Syndicate planets and go to the space bars and or the space ports not the space bars we'll go to the space ports and see if uh, see if by chance we can go ahead and encounter somebody that might start offering us some missions to work for the syndicate seems like the appropriate faction for a merchant to work for so we've got to actually I guess maybe start exploring some syndicate worlds here rather soon. Of course, every step of the way we can always buy more cargo each time we're gonna head off somewhere. We can always go there with a full cargo hold. Let's check the job board. We're gonna have to make a trip to Earth before too long though. Now, okay, forget the job board. So yeah, these are syndicate worlds over here. We've got syndicate worlds up here. This is Republic. Down here, you've got the free worlds. So you have some Republic ones there. Republic stretches down here a pretty good ways. I think I'd like to get mixed in with the Syndicate, though. Alright, what's this mission? Right here. A family of two. We're gonna eventually head that way. When we start trying to uncover some Syndicate worlds and all. But right now, we're going to go sell off all these luxury goods. Right up here to Alfred. Then I think we're going to sell off all these shuttles. And buy another mule. The question is, can we upgrade the mule? I kind of missed the uh, this little message that told me how much money I made in profit as I left that planet. I would have liked to have known the answer to that. I actually have 44 crew members working for me right now. I think the did the heavy shuttles? They only require one. 
Well, I know I've got a few extra on my ship that we're keeping here just to perhaps potentially pirate some people. All right, trading. Let's sell all of that. We're going to go to the shipyard. Let's go ahead and sell all of these. Go clunker one, clunker two. Clunker three. Clunker four. Clunker five. Clunker six. And clunker seven. So that gives us uh, 5.5 million credits. We're going to go ahead and buy this guy. Um, what do we want to name him? The Oddball. All right. Let's check out the Outfitter. We want to sell the Sidewinder missiles on him. We don't want those. Oh, holy crap. Apparently it's got two Sidewinder missiles? Yeah, I didn't realize there were two of them. Okay. And... We'll sell that Ram Scoop. We don't really need that. It's nice and all, but we don't need it. Um... Okay, looking at here, we're going to sell the ion steering on this sucker. We're going to buy the atomic steering. We'll buy that one. And we can go ahead and buy a couple cargo bay expansions. I guess. We can buy an extra shield generator. Okay. We're going to stock up on metal here. We don't need that clothing. The metal, however, we want. I'm wondering if we're going to run out of credits here. I don't think so. I think we'll, we'll still have quite a bit left. Enough to pay our crew and all. But we can carry a good bit more now. What's our uh, maximum capacity? It's on up there. We can make a lot every time we take this trip. 1,200. Okay. Let's go ahead and depart here. Well, first of all, let's check the job board. We've got another mission at Earth. But that's not one that I want. We do have a mission here, though. 17 tons of surgical equipment. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. We'll make room for uh, the surgical equipment there. Two miners are hoping to go there. We'll go ahead and accept those. So eventually we're going to be heading around in that area. But for now we're going to go ahead and make this trip again. Only this time with four mules. And we can go ahead and make the trip in pretty good time. Since we don't have to wait for any slower shuttles to uh, turn and get into position and all. would have been quite good. Okay, hold on. Let me board this guy. We don't, we don't have any Republic here to uh, screw us up. And that's a good thing. Alright. Our odds of successfully capturing him are 100%. Okay, let's see what we got. 
We have succeeded in capturing them. So we got another jump here. And we will land. Whoa, he died way too quickly. Alright, trading. Well, let's sell that. Check the job board. What's that one? That's like a rush mission. Uh, we have another mission on Earth. Don't care about it. We want to buy more luxury goods here. We don't want those heavy metals, though. Luxury goods, that's what we want. We might have to take out a small loan here, though. Indeed, we are going to have to take out a small loan. Because we're going to eat through all the credits that we've got. Just buying these luxury goods. Actually, we're going to need a few more credits just to finish buying the luxury goods. So let's go to the bank. We'll take out. Apply for, oh, 300,000 credits. Actually, we might need more than that. I don't know. What is this stuff? 90,000 credits and 30,000 credits. Nah, forget about that. Trading. We need a hundred and seventy something more tons. Okay. Time to depart. Once we get to Alfred, we can sell this uh, ship that we captured here too, so. That's gonna be more good money. Apparently we didn't actually lose any men when we uh, capture that ship because I don't think I'm paying any death benefits we just have the uh, crew salaries and then hello apparently we lost our berserker or whatever that was it's following us let's let him catch up there he goes okay he's probably ready All right, time to land. Okay, trading, let's sell all of that. We're gonna go to the shipyard, we're gonna sell the Sunset Hunter for 1.89 million credits. I like it. That's quite good. That's almost enough to buy another friggin' mule. So let's pay off our uh, mortgage here. Let's pay all that. Check the job board. Nothing. Three point four five nine million credits. Well, those can carry thirty five cargo. That can carry one hundred and thirty. Ah, what the hell? We'll just buy several more of these, I guess. Clunker one. <laughs> and buy another one. Clunker two. Buy another one. Uh, let's buy one more. 
Joker for? Okay. Trading. Gonna buy a whole bunch of metal. I'm willing to bet that we made a pretty, pretty good amount when we sold off these luxury goods. I'm not even trying to do the math in my head, but it's a lot. It takes a long time to buy all the uh, cargo that we can fit in our cargo hold. This game is a little different from like something like the X series where you can't do this in the X series because Basically, it's based on supply and demand. So we made 600,000 credits from that last run. And we were going to make even more on this next one. We don't have to wait too long for the... Uh, Heavy shuttles to get into position. They get in position pretty quick. Their turning rate and everything pretty much matches our uh, our mules. They're just a little bit slower. Don't know what was going on there, but. I don't really care. Oh! Damn it. I wish I'd have. That was probably a big ship. I probably could have taken him and made a good chunk of money. Oh well. We need to hire some more crew, actually. Yeah, we'll take 12. Trading. Now then. I wish there was like a buy all button. We've got a sell all, but we need a buy all. We need to put a buy all button like right here. So you have sell all and buy all. And that would help out tremendously. I would be making millions of dollars in a matter of freaking minutes. We'd be adding a new mule to our fleet every every ten minutes. <laughs> Pretty much. Alright, depart. Set our course with Alfred. And off we go. Off we go again. So yeah, basically at this point, we're just kind of set in this uh, little motion here. Until we start exploring a bit, which we're going to do quite soon. Let's go ahead and land. Okay, trading. Let's sell all of that. So we're sitting here with 2.47 million credits now. Shipyard. Clunker 5. Yeah, we are getting close to that point where we can, <laughs> we can start buying multiple shuttles every time. Clunker 6. Alright, leave there. I'm gonna buy a whole bunch of metal. We will indeed be able to, uh, 
probably buy another mule on our next trip back to Alfred. Then I might, I don't know, I'm thinking about buying some fighters and then just going exploring. Because they do sell fighters here at this uh, particular shipyard. And our mules can carry fighters. Then I want to see if we can perhaps join the syndicate. If you're curious how to join the syndicate, so am I. But I'm pretty sure that we just need to go to some syndicate worlds and go to the spaceports. Somebody will start talking to us. Shouldn't take that long, really. Guarantee you we'll be doing it relatively soon. I was being scanned by the Republic ship. I hate the Republic ships. Yeah, you're dead. Goodbye. Frickin' Republic's got some nerve, man. Trying to find me a million credits for carrying some nerve grenades. Freaking jerks. I had my interference plating. That should have fix that okay trading we're gonna sell all that metal and we're gonna buy a whole lot of luxury goods yeah I'm pretty sure we can we should definitely be at that point where we can probably afford some uh, Another mule when we get here. After we sell the heavy shuttles, anyways. Uh, this this is the boring part. <laughs> if you're playing a merchant, this is where it gets boring. Just loading all this cargo. But I guess it's a good problem to have. It's sure not a bad problem. Job board. Still no more missions at Earth. I was hoping to pick up another one there sometime soon, but it's not happening. So, off we go to Alfred. Really? They're dead. They died entirely too quickly. I wonder how big of a ship I could potentially take over with my uh, mules here. Because with four of them, we could almost certainly disable some pretty good sized ships. I'm wondering if I have enough crew to actually take over something more than one of these fighters that we're taking over right now. I might want to just go ahead and crank up the number of uh, extra soldiers I've got hired. Trading, let's sell all of that. Let's go ahead and sell all of these guys. Yes. 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 And now we want to buy yet another mule, I think. I don't know why we'd want that. It would make a good flagship, though. The Beetlejuice Shipyards Leviathan has been in service 
since long before the Republic existed. Although considered today to be an outdated and clunky model, it's still a force to be reckoned with. One of these days, I might buy something like that. But uh, considering how much money I can make with all these mules, it won't be today. Uh, what's his name gonna be? Uh, da 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 da. Hot potato. All right, let's leave here. Let's go to the outfitter and get old hot potato fixed up. We need to sell these missile launchers because we don't want those. We're going to sell that. We're going to buy that. We'll buy this. We will buy two cargo expansions and we're gonna buy an extra shield generator what oh we need to sell the ram scoop now we can buy an extra shield generator okay so the question is can we buy all of that metal I think we can. Well, I don't know. No, I don't think we can. We're gonna have to actually have to take out a loan to be able to fill up our cargo hold a bit here. But we will pay that loan off rather rapidly. I just don't like the idea of taking out uh, an absolutely enormous loan. Actually, it might not be a bad idea to do that. We could take out a loan of 22 million credits and buy... <laughs> you know what? This sounds rather crazy, but... I'm actually thinking about doing that. Just taking out an absolutely ridiculous loan. What the hell? Let's try it. 22,724,000. Alright. That means our total loan payment. Eh, holy crap. That's a ridiculous loan payment. We better make some freaking money doing this. Alright, we're gonna buy another mule. What are we gonna name this sucker? Uh. Mr. T. And then we'll buy another one. This will be the Aardvark. We'll buy another one. This is going to be uh, the Sidewinder. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade these before we look at buying another one. So our turning rate on all these is 108. Well, we need to upgrade these guys. So let's sell that. Let's sell the ram scoop. Sell that. We're going to buy some atomic steering. 
we're going to buy an extra shield generator two cargo expansions we're going to do the same in the aardvark sell so these sidewinder missiles we're going to sell the ram scoop we're going to sell the iron steering we're going to buy the atomic steering we're going to buy a couple cargo expansions and a shield generator and again we're gonna do that here sell those sidewinders sell the ram scoop we're gonna sell the ion steering buy the atomic steering buy this atomic steering we're going to buy a shield generator and the cargo expansion let's buy one more mule here and we're gonna go to the outfitter we're gonna sell these sidewinder missiles sell the ram scoop sell the iron steering buy the atomic steering buy the atomic thruster what no the atomic steering buy the shield generator and buy a couple cargo expansions okay trading now we can buy 1200 more metal that's going to be a lot of tons of metal. It will indeed be a lot. We're going to make ridiculous amounts of money every time we uh, fly across here. We're going to have a lot to pay off on this loan. But that's probably going to be worth it in the end here. Okay, let's go ahead and depart. So we made 695,000 credits off of what we sold there, and that <laughs> that was before we had all this. We are paying 87,000 in mortgage payments. Hello, one of our... Uh, Mules is getting left behind here. Why is he getting left behind? What is the matter with him? Why is he slower than everybody else? Don't know the answer to that. But we're here now. All right, trading. Let's sell all of that. That brings us back up to 4 million credits. So we're going to buy 2,700 tons of luxury goods. This is going to indeed take a while. But the amount of money that we're making now is just going to be ridiculously high we should be able to pay this loan off in pretty good time just watching that <laughs> go down we're eating through some credits buying all this cargo but it's a very reliable way to make money should have actually done this a long time ago, to be perfectly honest. Because the amount of money that we can make doing this is definitely enough to pay those mortgage payments. I want to see how much we actually 
made just selling the uh, metal. As soon as we take off, I'll know the answer to that. And we're going to make a lot when we sell these uh, luxury goods. Alright, so we made 742,000 credits just selling the metal. And it's going to be a really good amount once we sell these uh, luxury goods. It's like the ones just got like a bad pilot or something. He's just not keeping up like the rest. What is that? That's the jackass. Why is the jackass lagging behind so much? Well, he's staying with us now. He was lagging behind. Alright, landing on follower now. And this is where we crank out a bunch of money here. Alright. Trading. Sell all of that. And we're going to buy a whole bunch of metal. And I believe after we buy this metal, we're going to pay a little bit extra on the uh, mortgage here. Because I don't like having a $22 million mortgage. That part's not fun. part kind of sucks indeed. Good grief, we're not even halfway there on the cargo. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, we really need a buy all button. If by chance somebody can speak to the uh, developer of the game, just tell them to put a little buy all button right here. So, whatever you've got selected, it will buy all of that. Or maybe a buy all button somewhere up here on the line would be great. Because it really sucks doing this. Doesn't make for good video either. Just sit here and watch me loading like 3,000 tons of something into my cargo holds. Okay, so we still have four million credits extra. Let's go to the bank. We're gonna pay, oh. Let's do 1,500,000. That dropped our uh, daily payment down by about 5,000. Hello, apparently we have the wrong destination set. We could do this like multiple times <laughs> and just further increase the size of our fleet like with a ridiculous speed. Because we're making more than what we're paying in interest by a pretty long shot. Oh, I forgot to look and see how much money we actually made. I wanted to see how much we made selling the luxury goods. I'll have to pay close attention to that when we go there again. I pity the pirate who tries to mess with us now. So all that. Now then. So I think what we make, like 700,000 credits here? Just coming to sell some metal? Yeah, I challenge you to find a mission that's going to pay anywhere near that. You can't even pirate and make that. Not reliably. I mean, maybe... You might get lucky, I guess if you know where to find some big ships to take out. And you don't have, you know, Republic military there that's 
screwing you over and blowing up the ship. Yeah, you can probably do pretty good then. You know, probably better than this. But this is, like, reliable money right here. This is money that you can count on. Now, by the time we get back there, well, we are going to have paid a pretty good bit in our mortgages and all. We're being scanned by the Republic ship Beta 7, Gamma 2, Delta 4, and Red 12. I hate the Republic. We are going to bring a freaking shitstorm of mules to just rape the Republic here. <laughs> <laughs> After we join the syndicate. Alright, so yeah, we made 742,000 credits transporting the metals. And I know it's a lot more than that. It's like a million and a half credits, pretty much, probably, too. Ah, oh, he's already dead. Don't slow me down here. You're costing me money. I can't hardly stop to pirate the pirates because this is where I make my money. Four hundred ninety-three thousand credits. That just dropped down to four hundred thousand credits. We're definitely paying a lot in that mortgage. There's no doubt about that. Alright, trading. Sell all of that. That brings us back up to 4,300,000. Okay, I want to do this one more time just so I can actually see how much we actually made. I wouldn't mind paying a little extra on that mortgage again, though. We just want to make darn sure that we have enough money to buy the luxury goods for the return trip. Because those luxury goods are where the real money is at. And if we don't have enough money to buy those, then we have to take out more of a loan. And then that just sucks, and yeah. I'd rather avoid all that suckiness. We need, yeah, that's kind of funny. We need almost three million credits just to, just to buy the luxury goods that we're transporting. That alone just tells you how much exactly we're really transporting. Dear. I really, really wish there was a buy all button. Or I wish it would go faster than that, anyways. So, yeah, we could still take up another loan for 5.621 million credits. Uh. Let's pay an extra. Uh, 700,000 That just dropped us down to 88,000 per turn, so that's a little better. It's an improvement anyways. Okay. We made a profit of 1.331 million credits. So yeah, that's nothing to sneeze at. We're making Basically, two million credits every time we make this trip. Two million credits every time we go back and forth between these two planets. Except for all the uh, mortgage payments that we're making. Let's 
79,000 in mortgage payments. Yeah, those missiles have no chance to hit us. We have a lot of anti-missile turrets. Among all of my ships, oh yeah. Oh shoot, we probably just disabled those guys. I probably could have cleaned them up and turned them in here. Alright, so all that. We're going to go ahead and end this video here too. So, As always, if you enjoy our videos, I hope you'll like and subscribe. And we'll see you again soon. Thank you very much.